It looks like purple is the tag to look for for half off. And that Goodwill I popped in just to see what's in the shelves tonight, Saturday night at Goodwill. I like those mint little tulip uh, candle holders. That color was so pretty. It was $4.99 for the pair. I think that's an ornament as well as this right here, $2.99. That was cute. I think that's maybe a Christmas piece. I like this one. $7.99. It's, it's higher in. It's up there. About $99 for a little coaster. $2.99 for a uh, little vase. Aha! I spot an owl. You cannot hide from me, my friend. $2.99. If I see you, I just may give you a home. Into my cart you go. Mm, I like this one. This is a uh, really nice looking candle holder. I'm just doing a check to make sure there's no chips that I can feel. I can't see anything. It appears to have survived in um, amazing condition. So we're going to take that one for a couple bucks. Add it to the candle holder section. I think this is uh, like a candle holder as well. Not sure if the shape is anything specific, but it kind of looks like a silo or maybe even like a rocket ship to me, but I think it's a lantern. What shape would you call it? Hmm, just a neat little tray there. Oh my gosh, I love this. So it's a butterfly, it's beautiful, colorful, but it's painted shell like you'll see you see that on the inside there so it's like made out of shells that come together and the wings touch and it's painted do you see that yeah isn't that wild i've never seen that before but i thought that is so pretty for a couple dollars yes please does it bring you joy yes it does okay that does not bring me joy all right keep going son you don't even look just look the other way oh a chippy vase see this color is gorgeous this kind of threw me for a second because like what that's tj maxx it looks so old right i mean it still has the tag on it but it's done in a very old um just really used shabby uh format 5.99 it was nice but i'm gonna leave it there that was so pretty look at those just that fun just the fun colors that are used here and the very expressive flowers. $4.99 this piece is. It does have some uh, things chipped off the back of it, some pieces. But very pretty. Just a decorative piece. Ceramic. A shelf sitter. This was a made, a made in Mexico um, beautiful art piece. A vase. I think this one is supposed to have a lid. What do you think? It looks like almost like, I don't know, there was something inside of it. I like these guys. So these look to be a set. There's a set of three. The first one is a vase. And then these two are candle holders. So I'm like, oh, they're nice. Like these are in great shape for $2.99. Sometimes it's harder to find buyers for the clear stuff, but I feel like if it's, it looks really nice and the price is right. So I feel like this is in the wheelhouse of, I could price it and people will fall in love with it and snag it right up. Oh, that's another beautiful vase. $4.99 for this one. Oh, that beautiful etching. That one may glow. I feel like I've come across that one in my travels before and with the UV light, it uh, may be manganese. Put those all in the cart. That's a pretty vase. Anybody else love stripes and flowers? It says Laura Ashley. Here's the colors. This is a very hefty lamp cover shade maybe on top of a candle it goes what do you think this is i'm assuming it's a candle holder but it's done so that it looks like i mean at least it could be used as a candle holder that's what i'm seeing when i look at it right now so these pieces are fused together 
There is no lid, uh, but it does look like, you know, like a cup and saucer. Hey, Stanley. Stanley came to... Can you hear Stanley? Do you have anything to say, Stanley? Ah, you want to say hi? Do you hear Stanley say hi? He came to say hello to you guys. So, oh, you guys are cute. Not sure what these guys are, but they're so cute. This is called a cobra stand. We sell these in the shop. And your abalone shell, a lot of times, uh, those are used as a beautiful tripod for the shells. This bird, I think he's winking at me. Could not find a price on him. He's got two different colors of eyes. He's a cutie patootie. We shall call him a speckled bird. All right, buddy, I'll see you around. Maybe you'll have a price the next time I see you. Then we have this guy. He looks like a handmade piece. This was the heaviest bell ever. Do not drop that one on your toe. Obviously, it's a newer one. Oh, I like this piece of decoration. That's nice. Wooden. It's got like little flowers, daisy flowers, carved up through the front of it. That's beautiful. That is so cozy. What a beautiful piece. Yeah. We're going to gobble that right up. I wanted to see what was behind this because I could see the top part and I saw the crown. And so I'm like, ooh, I want to see what's on here. I think it says, you are loved with a beautiful crown. Couldn't get that one open, but Oscar the Grouch probably lives in there and he's like probably like, nope, don't bother me. More bells. More cow bells. Uh, let's see. So we're in the metal section now. Bopping around here. $2.99. I debated. I actually sold one of these in the shop today. I was debating on getting another one, but I'm like, oh, let's just see what else is here. Are you seeing anything? I have no idea. Maybe a plate rack? What that white piece was? I'm going to guess a plate rack of some sort. I have no idea what that is down there. That looks to be a hot plate. Oh, this fabric, the design drew me in. Oh, look at that. Owls. I think this is a pillow. I think this is a pillow. It's, it's just like a pillow with, I don't know. Maybe it makes your pillow easier to carry. I don't know. Unless it was supposed to be part of something. Um, this was so pretty. $4.99. Oh my gosh. So this is like a felt purse. It's got that the beautiful florals, the colors. You would definitely need to clean it. Take it, um, you know, it needs a lint roller. Run away, exercise bike. Lots of regular bikes here. I guess it's the end of the summer and people are cleaning out. I was talking to um, staff today, and right now they're currently open till 8 o'clock at night. But um, he shared that pretty soon they'll be changing their hours. That during the summer, um, I think this is a, uh, maybe a sound instrument, that over the summer um, they do extended hours. Because, of course, like he said, people are cleaning out, doing lots of yard sales, lots of donations happening at the end of the day. But now we are going into a different part of the season, so... He said, expect the hours to change soon. Oh my gosh, I love this owl. $2.99. Do you remember when that was really popular? When you, um, like, I can remember salespeople going around the town that I grew up in and um, asking parents if they want to have, like, school photos done in varnish and, like, these really ornate edges put on it. Does anybody else remember that time um, where you would get things? I guess the word is lacquered. Oh, that's so nice. I love these little vignettes of these little girls. Look at that. Bonnets and bows. $2.99 a piece. Does anybody recognize what they're from? I mean, you can put a little command strip on the back of these. And they are so sweet to add to a wall to decorate with. Or to put even like, a, you know, one of those plate holders. And just sit it up. I think that would be so cute. So sweet. Little jars filled with all kinds of candies and stuff. Very vintagey. Very cottage core. Just, yeah. I'm going to take a minute to look through the signs here. This, this 
particular goodwill has really expanded on all kinds of signs. Born to shine. Aroma diffuser. That might have been a deal for somebody. Some string art on the bottom shelf there. Lots of welcome signs. It's Jordan's football hanger down there. Some kitty cats. I think that's a napkin holder with the kitty cats. Maybe salt and pepper will go on the front of them of the kitty cat itself. And this is a Ray Dunn piece. This would make a nice gift. It says courage. Somebody could use it as a trinket dish or even as a soap dish. <laughs> 